special to be back here in China, you know, second year, Swatch Girls Pro, here a few days before the contest, and just kind of decided to hide out with my friend Jen and Candice and just get some waves, like at a different little bay before. It's just a great way to start off the trip in China and, and get ready for the event. to get my feet about me in the in the you know sea of china has been like so awesome and the waves have been super fun the water is warm today was like waist high and peeling lefts and rights perfect little beach break waves really fun a good way to just warm up before uh, before getting into the contest Amazing, it's like a paradise here, and we had perfect two, two foot waves this morning, glassy, nobody out. And uh, yeah, it's just nice to be with my friends and just surf some nice waves in a bikini and just relax. Yeah, it's cool to be be here a few days early and get to see the actual culture, the people that live here, the people that are the fishermen, the people that are, you know, growing rice in the fields, you know, um, and they're all just like amped. They're interested in Westerners. They like to look at you, wave at you, sometimes touch you, kind of stuff like that. Bringing surfing to a culture that is new to it has just been fantastic because it's like already since last year we've seen it grow so much. It's going to change people. It's going to change the way the Chinese deal with things hopefully and, and also their impact on the ocean. Bringing them to the ocean to look at it from a different perspective is going to hopefully open up people's eyes to keeping that clean and you know keeping it, keeping it surfable.